trouble getting apps to load on your Chromecast? Well, I do went through the hassle of getting my apps to run smoothly on my Chromecast and sure enough, it wasn't a pleasant experience. Luckily, I know just what you need to do to get this issue fixed. So stick around till the end of this video and make sure to not miss any of the troubleshooting steps that I go through to find the perfect solution that works for you. There is no doubt that a stable network connection is paramount when it comes to content transmission, especially with streaming and video playback. Apps like YouTube, Netflix, Hulu and Amazon Prime all demand a certain bandwidth allocation to perform at their fullest. In the absence of a stable network connection with viable speeds and latency, most apps turn up slow or out and out unusable. So let's start troubleshooting this issue on your Chromecast by checking out the network connection. You can do just that with a speed testing application like Oogla or by visiting the website speedtest.net. All you need to do is get another device like your phone connected to the same network as the Chromecast and run the speed test. If this test reflects a negative outcome with subpar speeds and latency, the network is for sure at fault here. In such cases, I recommend that you get your network refreshed with the power cycle test before calling in your ISP. By power cycling your network router, you get to refresh the system internals as well as bleed the router of any static charges which can hinder the proper functioning of the device. All you need to do is unplug the router from the power supply, leave it idle for about a minute and then plug it back in. Once the router powers up, run the speed test once again and check if you notice any positive outcome. If yes, connect your Chromecast to the same network once again and check for the issue now. And finally, if signal strength is the issue at hand here, simply move your router closer to your Chromecast and minimize the obstructions between the devices. Opting for a mesh network or a Wi-Fi extender is also advisable, but they do come at a cost. If you have been running your Chromecast on outdated firmware, then you can face issues like this. So better check if your Chromecast is updated to the most recent firmware available. To do so, head over to the Settings tab of your Chromecast and select System. Then open the About tab and select System Update. Your device will now run a check for any pending updates. Once your Chromecast completes the update, check for the issue now. Now, let's look at the other end of the spectrum and concentrate on the apps that have been causing the problem. Bugs are a probable cause in such cases. Applications, especially streaming apps, can become bloated over time. And the best way to cleanse your Chromecast apps of such inconsistencies is to clear the app cache and data. To do so, head over to the Settings tab and open the Applications tab. Next, select the See All Apps and choose the app that have been putting up the issue. Select Clear Cache and confirm your selection. If you still face issues with the application, consider uninstalling and reinstalling the application. To uninstall an app from your Chromecast, select Uninstall from the same apps menu from before. Then simply reinstall the application from the Play Store and you're good to go. If the steps that I mentioned so far didn't work for you, I recommend that you reset your Chromecast to its default configuration. In doing so, you get to revert all the system settings and user data to the factory defaults and remove all persistent bugs from the system, essentially giving you a new slate to start with. And so, to factory reset your Chromecast, all you need to do is press and hold the reset button on your device for about 20 seconds upon which the LED blinks yellow for newer generations, orange for second gen Chromecast or red for first gen devices. The LED will then turn white upon which you can release the button. After completing the reset, set up your device like new and check if your issues persist. And that's pretty much all I wanted to talk about regarding fixing a Chromecast that won't load applications. If you found this video useful, 
do consider leaving your thoughts below give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more interesting chromecast content like this